Sad. Hello. Nice, nice, nice. All right, Noodles versus Swift. Losers finals. Swift trying to make up for his uh, loss to uh, to Slocks in uh, in Muna's finals earlier. I think this is three out of five. Are we gonna see a Fox data? What are we gonna see? For those of you who don't know, I hate the Fox data. I think it's almost as bad as like Falco data. Oh, okay, good. Nice. You got Noodles who's gonna go as a. Uh, as Fox, and I think Swift is going to go as Marth. Swift. Swift. Yeah. Fox versus Marth. Classic matchup in the game. Been going on for years. Ooh. So in this matchup, Fox has to watch out for uh, multiple grabs, chain grabs. Just getting grabbed out of things. You don't want to stop his momentum. This matchup, though, uh, Mark's got to watch out for uh, shines, especially trying to recover. If Fox shines you, you probably won't recover from that. Go watch out for tippers, got to watch out. Hmm. I like how pressing uh, side B is uh, making a comeback. Ever since Ken, uh, what was it? It was like Kings of Cali 2 or something, or 3, where he just like showed up and played like Star or whatever and like pressed the 7 set. Uh, he started like whipping out those... Uh, those forward bees. And it's been making a comeback. You see a lot of people using it. Muta King used it. PP was using it. And, uh. Where was it? I know he used that at uh, a lot of Apex. I think he was playing a set against, uh. I forgot who it was. But I saw him use it a lot. It's nice. You got a Red Apart Renown Smash where you got a lot of, like, old and new blending together to make this really nice looking like, main or something. So that's pretty cool. Ooh, going for the edge guard. He misses it. Swift misses those edge guards. Ah, and it gets kicked in the face. But no matter. Three apiece, and Swift is up. Almost the full stock. Goes for that side B, doesn't get it, but goes for that forward smash. Charges the uh, charges the B, hits him, and... Well, I don't know. Oh, there we go. Ooh. You saw that they were both trying to bait a grab. Didn't work out. First Fox went, then, uh, then Marth went. Then they were able to get the grab, though. So Fox has been doing a better job capitalizing on the uh, the missed little grab situation from 10 seconds ago. Trying to get each other's space. Marth doesn't really want to be below Fox, so you sort of see Marth trying to uh, trying to stay below the platforms. But Fox doesn't really want to be above above Marth though. So with that sword, he has an incredible range and can just get you. All right, forward smash from uh, from Swift base. Take that stock. Three uh, three to one healthy lead in every sense of the word from Swift base. He looks like he probably has this in the bag, but we don't know. Oh my god, we don't know. Look at that back air. Shoutouts to back air. Saving the day for foxes. Ooh, but he really gets entrapped in that little corner. You notice how Martha was like positioned, I don't know, I don't want to say like in the he was in the middle of the save, but it was like in a good quarter uh, on one of the sides, so that way his sword can, can reach one of the edges and one of the other edges. So he pretty much has like a good control of, I don't know. Ooh. And side B to finish it out. But he bans a uh, fountain again. Uh, you got Locke who says uh, he's gonna save one at Zenith. So you guys at Zenith. Zenith. Great tournament. Oh shoot. All right, so I think Noodles uh, counterpicked to Dreamland. And uh, and you have Noodles again going as, uh, as Fox. But you have Swift Pace going as Sheik. Dreamland misses the text. He's able to get the uh, the up smash. Ooh, look at that. Trying to fish for some up air. Trying to get something out of that. Not going to work out. You got Swift Pace. Kicks him in the face. Throws him. Punches him in the face. Just slaps him. Slap, slap, slap. None of those peach slaps. None of those like really like pfft, assertive slaps. Oh shoot! That was a great love smash from Noodles. Chasing Swift all around the uh, the stage. Again, you see uh, Noodles, Fox, trying to stay limber, trying to stay uh, unpredictable, going in and out, weaving in and out. But it doesn't matter. Swift catches him. Goes for the uh, goes for the tech chase. Doesn't get it. Ah, too bad. Noodles shines out. 
Get out of the pressure. Good new proto from Swift, though. And you gotta get in a double jump back air. I really like that from Noodles. Ooh, that's a mistake. That's gonna be a stock. Oh, darn it. Alright. Good edge guard from Swift. Questionable movement from Noodles. But he goes with the up smash again. Ah, and he got him in a grab. Got him in a grab. Missed the tech, so he doesn't uh, does up smash again. You saw that earlier in this, the, uh, I think the first stock. Gets him, needles him off, and that's gonna be a stock. Oh man, this is brutal. I mean, he got Noodles, who's like a really good player, playing Swift, who just shows you, you know, the kind of skill that we have in this one tournament. Wow. Alright. Going for those tech chases, working out two in a row. Goes forward air. Nice back air. You see a lot of those. You see a lot of people uh, trying to bait, trying to be people trying to get in and just like back airs them. They don't like change the position, they just stay where they are. New King does that a lot with like his uh, his forward airs though. But I guess back airs which just says well, and it works great for Swift, who's up 2 0 against Noodles. I have a feeling uh, Noodles though is gonna want to go back to Dreamland. Except this dude behind us in a chair. Comfy chair. Yep, and we're right back. All right, starting off shooting some lasers. Is he gonna shoot some more lasers in this game? Trying to be a little more patient. How is he gonna go about this? No, he's just going straight at him. We've seen like five signs so far. Just been neutral airing, trying to get him some back airs. Ooh, Firefox stall. All right, nice, nice. I think uh, Nils is going for a more in-your-face approach this time. Alright. He can't really let Swift get a hold of him. Because those grabs last game were really big momentum changers. Ooh, that's gonna be a, that's gonna be a stock. Or will it? Oh my god! Oh my god. That was a good job from Noodles, but uh, Swift was able to, you know, just beat him out for that. Goes for an up smash, fortunately gets the back of it. Apparently the up smash like begins like the uh, the hitbox sort of like begins at the back, but I don't think it has as much of an effect. Like it definitely doesn't. Even though like it might begin there. That's not where it's the most powerful. Uh intercepts him trying to get back on the ledge. He's not gonna be able to get back this time. He's struggling. Noodles is struggling. And he's getting grabbed. Nice. I really like that. Trying to shine and get out of the pressure. Ooh. Read where he's gonna go. This might be it. Ah, ah shoot. Position to the back here, just too far back. Doesn't really get it. Doesn't connect. Whoa, baby. All right. He's just playing around with him. That was nice. That was nice. He can totally make this. Don't get force locked. Don't do it. Don't do it. You won't have to apologize, but just don't do it. Oh my god. Oh. Ooh, and there we go. We got at least uh, got at least one slack off him. It really looks like Swift figured him out at this point. He's really going to try and uh, stop his momentum, grab him, shove him off, use those needles, get uh, get an advantage that way, and then just the rest of the game just falls in Sheik's favor once you do that. Once you limit Fox's options, she's like shooting fish in a barrel. Bam, bam, bam. Throws him off. Oh, goes for forward air. Doesn't get it. That was that was interesting. Wonder why he did that. Back air, back air. Man. Ooh. Fox going for back air. Goes for neutral air. Kicks him off. Oh no. And Swift is able to neutral air him off, and then forward airs him off, and that's the game for Noodles. That's the end. He gets third place. Third place for Noodles. Incredible run. And we're gonna have grand finals. Swift base versus slot.